Hi YouTubers, Eclectic Lil here. I have a small jewelry haul. I purchased these uh, pins um, at the clubhouse down where my mom and son live about two hours south of here. And this lady had a bunch of jewelry in the clubhouse. And I picked these pins out. They're only a dollar a piece. And so the first one is this um, Mother of Pearl Dove uh, pin. And it says Bethlehem on it. <clears throat> and then I got this uh, Sarah Coventry pen. It's very pretty with the ruby red rhinestone swirl. Kind of looks like a flower. And it says uh, Sarah Coventry on there. I don't know if you could see that too well, but it's on there. Um, then I thought this was really pretty. It's a vase with flowers. It's very colorful. And it says Da Vinci. I tried to pick out uh, brooches or pins that had a name on the back. Very cute. Um, and then I just, uh, and to test pins to see if they're Bakelite, I bought that cream, um, that you get a cotton swab and you rub it on it. And if it turns yellow, um, <clears throat> then it's, uh, Bakelite. Um, I'll put it down in the description box, the name of it. This is pretty flowered pin and that says something hold on oh Avon this was the Avon pin you can't see it it's really tiny under there um, then this next one is Coro. It's got those pretty rhinestones in there. It's marked Coro. Um, this was really pretty floral pen. I don't think this one was marked. I thought it was, but it's not. Oh, actually it was marked and it was so far under. You can't really see the initials. So, um, I couldn't really find the name of it, but that, I thought that was really pretty. Um, then this was a unique one. This is a, uh, I think he's a stork and he has a cigar in his mouth and he has a cane it's very old it's got a rhinestone on his lapel or uh, his tie hanging down and it's not marked and for the life of me I could not find this pen but it's an old D1 thank you Okay, and then uh, these two things are keychains, and they're bought at two different places. And again, I only paid like a dollar each. This is from Paris, France. It's marked Paris, France. It's a keychain. And then this is a vintage uh, witch keychain. Thought those are really cool. Remind me uh, of those witches on those vintage Halloween uh, cardboard cutouts that you buy. And then um, 
so these were at a different place, different thrift shop, um, where I go to buy my dollar, my six dollar jewelry bags. They usually have a tray of uh, dollar pins. This one says made in China uh, EU. But I thought that was kind of a, a cool one for Halloween. And then um, I'm trying to remember where I got these. These were um, in a bag of, uh, I think I got these out of a bag of my jewelry. And uh, it's a Christmas Santa. This uh, little gingerbread boy is on like a wire. That's kind of cute. And then this one's made of clay. And on his, above his legs, he has little buttons. Um, the little bear pin. So that's cute. And then this, uh, Deer pen. Again, I thought it was marked, but it wasn't. It has rhinestones. I found this in gold, but not with the rhinestones. Um, so I gotta look a little more. So then um, at the store where I buy my six dollar jewelry bags recently, well, you won't see this for a few days, but um, this video. Um, Cause I already have another one that um, I already recorded that you'll see that first. This looks almost like that shrinky dink material. Uh, the Santa earrings. I thought they were so cute. But those were a dollar. And um, then I got this uh, Christmas uh, Santa made in Hong Kong. It's supposed to light up the nose. I'm going to just change out the battery and uh, put a battery in there. And then this pretty, I love this uh, holly and pine cone with the red ribbons. And this is Russ. And uh, again, I love all these types of older button uh, brooches and pins. So, um, oh, and then I got this uh, down where the pins were. This is a ornament. I'll just put it in with this lot. It says Wallace Sterling, 1973, Peace on Earth, Goodwill Toward Ben. And this was selling for 23 to $25. I got it for a dollar. See the Wallace down there, Sterling. So that's my little jewelry haul today. Um... Hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. I do jewelry videos once a week and thrift haul videos. And I thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Ciao.